Do aliens live amongst us? The world has changed. UFO chasers now know they can no longer be labeled as people wearing tinfoil hats. The confirmation they longed for came from the one source they would always blame for all the cover-ups, the Pentagon. Top Pentagon officials stated that there are now almost 400 reports from military personnel of possible UFO encounters. Many experts now call them UAPs, unexplained aerial phenomena. Numerous Freedom of Information Act requests have resulted in more than 1,500 pages of UFO-related materials being released by the government. This includes strange reports that certain UFO encounters reportedly left witnesses with radiation burns and unaccounted for pregnancy. These videos show the aircrafts operating at hypersonic speeds, surpassing the speeds reached by highly qualified U.S. Navy pilots. The U.S. Navy officially confirmed and declassified the videos in April 2020, but have provided no explanation for what the mysterious objects might be. So why all the cover-ups? Could the theory of our technological advancement being credited to ETs be true? Have there actually been encounters with ETs? We've seen the hoaxes and explanations for objects being mistaken for the planet Venus or satellites. But what about all the other sightings? The 1,500-page report, the video footage, not to mention the allyship with China and the enormous budget being allocated to this. It's worth being aware that hundreds of federal projects have been funded, despite never having been proven valid or effective, including the Star Wars Missile Defense Program, Abstinence-Only Sex Education, and the DARE Anti-Drug Program. Nevertheless, we must acknowledge that the Pentagon will help in speeding up the identification process of these objects in a methodical and logical manner, using tools to scientifically validate each report. Whether you are a skeptic or a believer, many sightings can now be backed by actual governmental documents and evidence. The long-awaited union of UFO enthusiasts, scientists, and the government is upon us. This is just the beginning. Oh.